Here's everything that you need to know about the new egg pan, including all of the new recipes and how to get it. So you need the excellent pan quest, and this quest unlocks after you finish the Rockadoodle or Roundup, and then that quest you get at level 8 with Peckle if you've unlocked the Nature Preserve. So once you start this quest, Peckle will have you go over to play the Rockadoodle or Roundup. You don't even have to win. You just need to play it once, go talk to Peckle and Pom Pom Pudding, and then Pom Pom Purine will ask you what you're going to do with all of the eggs from the game. And then Peckle suggests the old campfire. So you have to give Pom Pom Purine 10 wood blocks and 10 ingots so he can fix up and light the campfire. And the first thing they have you cook is an omelet. You can put any ingredient in. I just did some moon cheese because who doesn't love a good cheesy omelet. And once you make this one, you have to give it to Pom Pom Purin. And of course, he loves it. At the end of this first quest, you get the crafting plans for the egg pan station. This means that you can craft it and put it in any visitor cabin, or even your own. This is really useful so you don't have to run all the way up there every time you want to make something. It is quite expensive though, so save up those eggs. So now, for the five star quest, which unlocks after you capture the 108 Gudetama, once you get to 108, you should be able to get that second slot and unlock the five stars quest. Pom Pom Purin will have you craft some crepes, which all of the crepes need eggs and flour, when the omelets only really need eggs. So he has you craft some sweet crepes, and then deliver them all around to all of your friends. So after you give one to Karomi, my Melody, Hello Kitty, and Cinnamon Roll, which Cinnamon Roll has the cutest little answer. After you get all of your five star rankings, head back to the dessert boat to tell Pom Pom Purin. And the sweet crepe is a success. So now let me show you all of the recipes that we have so far. Let's start with the omelets. First, the fluffy omelet needs eggs and moon cheese. The hearty omelet needs spin-up and moon cheese. The veggie supreme needs spin-ups and pumpkins. The fantasy omelet needs candy cloud. The protein omelet needs tofu. The veggie omelet, you can either use spin-ups or pumpkins. Make sure to do both to unlock both recipes. The normal crepe is just eggs and flour. The chocolate crepe is just flour and chocolate coins. The cheese crepe is flour and moon cheese. The fruit crepe is flour and either strawberries, bananas, pineapple, starfruit, or apples. Make sure to do all five to unlock all of the recipes. The nutty crepe is just flour and toasted almonds. And the sweet crepe is flour and sugar kelp or candy cloud or swamp mellow. Make sure to do all three to unlock it. And then the spiced crepe is flour and magma bloom or cinnabloom. And do both as well. And for the veggie crepe, you can either use pumpkin or spinach with flour. If you're missing any, make sure you look back and do all of the duplicates, especially for the fruit crepe, because there's five of those, where some other recipes have two. So make sure to keep an eye out for that. And I just love how you can make one for your house. I made this cute little campsite looking room. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. What's your favorite recipe?